What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. It is your boy Mr. Squatch and we are back with some more Ark Survival Evolved Mobile. But before we get into anything, make sure if you are not subscribed to subscribe, smash the like button and as always turn on post notifications so you get notified anytime I go live or post a video. And also go ahead and uh, check out the merch down below in the, uh, it'll be below the description. You know, I have some nice little cute pictures uh, of all my awesome merch. Go ahead and pick up some merch guys. It'll immensely help me if you do so. So go ahead and check that out. Pick something up if you guys enjoy it. If not, it's fine. I appreciate your view and you just being here hanging out with me. Um, come say hi in the stream. Come chill with us. I stream almost every single night. But without further ado, let's get into this. Today, I wanted to talk to you guys about RAS building, right? I, uh, I'm not huge into RAS, but over the last, you know, few months, I've been taught a lot how to build, you know, basically pretty powerful rafts. Now, rafts are very glitchy. They have issues. You can run them into other rafts and mesh into people's stuff. You can mesh rafts into structures, the map, all sorts of crazy stuff. But if you just like having a little raft base, I'm going to show you guys how to sink the foundations inside of the raft. That way you can build down underneath the raft above it you can layer your walls you can layer your ceilings you can layer your doors all sorts of insane stuff if you build it the way i'm going to show you guys how to build it so first of all obviously have a raft okay now um i always take the sail off so if you want just hide sail um well you're gonna really need to hide the sail anyway um first step you want to do is grab a uh fence foundation wooden wooden's the cheapest just just do wooden now you want to place it in this little slot right here, literally in the exact middle of this slot. Now, sometimes this can be a process getting it just perfect. Um, like that's probably a little bit too far over. So I'm going to pick it back up. It, it's kind of difficult to get it perfect. You might have to do it two or three times, but we're going to, we're going to put this right here. Okay. And then you want to take your, uh, your pillar you want to put your pillar right here right right there basically not all the way out not all the way in just in the middle of that then take your thatch foundation and see if it'll snap next to it and if it won't you're gonna have to do you're gonna have to basically you know place it again see how it's not gonna it'll snap in the middle but it won't snap next to it so that means you need to pick this up you that's why you want to make a couple of these um, because you might have to demo these so we're gonna go ahead and make another one and we want to try and like I said get this perfect because you need to sit you need to put this all the way around the raft so let's go ahead and see if we can get this perfect it's like I said it's kind of a process to get it sometimes okay we'll try it right there let's put this right there and it's still not wanting to sink for some reason it wants to see how we'll go over here but watch if, if we try going all the way around it won't let us see how we can go right here but we can't go next to it that's the issue so you need to make sure that you can go on either side of it. Now that I put the underneath, I gotta go destroy it, but all right, let's pick that back up. All right, get out of my way. Let's demo that. I just like to show you guys the, uh, the, the, the issues I also have with buildings and it might be we're too close to the shore. So let's actually go out a little bit and let's see, can I place it now? No, I still can't place it. Like I said, you gotta be pretty dang perfect. Okay, we're gonna try this again. We're gonna get all the way out. Okay, I think we're over too far this way. That's the issue. Okay, let's go right here. I usually do it pretty quick. I usually don't, it's, the issue is like moving, right? You move too much one direction, you move too much another direction. That's the issue with it. There we go. So now we can get it and we can get over here. So once you have that and you know you can place it, uh, you know you can place that and you place this one, you don't have to go all the way with that foundation unless you want to double check and make sure that you can go all the way around, right? So we should be good there. We have that, we have that. Now what you wanna do is if you want, you obviously want metal because you want it to be strong. So come into your, you know, your smithy. Um, we're gonna go ahead and grab foundations. Okay, we'll come over here. Go back to our wrap. It might have just been because I was too close to the certain to the shore. And you just want to replace these with metal, okay? Go all the way around. Okay, now obviously you're gonna have to destroy this. Okay. Come on. And then make sure you place one right in the center. So now we have 
foundation sunken into the base all the way around so someone would have to destroy all your foundations to destroy your raft right um obviously mounting your raft is going to be a little bit harder now because you don't really have a hole or anywhere to mount it but you can go underneath like this and sometimes you can look through it and see your raft and actually be able to mount it i'm trying to see if i can get it up here there you go you can just do like that look up okay now we have the raft all all the structures and foundations mounted right and then what you can do is you can take walls and ceilings and go all the way out and down under the raft and actually make basically an enclosure under your raft so let me go ahead and go make sure everything else is crafted up i'll come back with the walls and we will see if we can actually go down under the raft above the raft and i'll show you guys also how to layer the walls so we'll be back here in a few seconds guys all righty we are back we have our ceilings our foundation or our walls and our fence foundations so first of all what you can try doing is i've been able to get these to snap before this way but get in the water and then see how the walls are only uh letting me go up on top get a uh, ceiling sorry get a ceiling place the ceiling right now you should be able to place the wall right there on the actual like connection uh let me go ahead and kill these guys real quick so they don't you know we don't have fight music okay so then grab your wall and now you can place your wall see i didn't mean to place that one so then you can go up here you can demo this um if you want it to go out that far you can right i I'm, I'm more of keeping the raft a little bit smaller so go ahead and grab the next wall um well i think you have to place them all the way around yeah okay now we'll grab the walls bam bam and like i said you're gonna have to go like all the way around with the ceilings just to make sure they're just to make sure you can place the walls so we'll go all the way around I know it's kind of hard to see in the water sometimes um so i mean it's okay if you mess up and have to uh you know and bam okay cool and i'm drowning let's let's, let's put drowning you might want to use some scuba gear if you're doing this okay now we'll place this one and rafts can be very glitchy whenever you're building on them so you're probably gonna have a lot of mess ups a lot of times where you know you put it in the wrong place see, like that right there kind of like glitches back and forth bam 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 oh crap no no i don't want you to go there okay now do that again right there so now you have that if you wanted to you could go ahead and i think no i think we have to build one more layer i think we have to do one more layer of walls I, i'm trying to remember because it's been a little while since i've done this um let's get some water real quick though okay I, i'm basically gonna enclose the bottom of the raft right so we'll go back under We'll go ahead and place another layer. So place this right here. You can also, by the way, do this and you can actually put a vault under here. So if you wouldn't want to keep your stuff inside the base, you could actually put and conceal vaults under here. Now what we'll do is now you can place the, the, um, the ceiling. So this is one extra layer of protection underneath your raft that way and i ran out of walls but that way no one can destroy your like they would have to go through that then the foundations and you can even go further underneath i think one layer of foundations and one layer of ceilings is, is like plenty i think you're good on that and then you come up here you're gonna have to destroy this because i can't get on right now you need to make a ramp like that's one thing you want to do is you, you want to make a ramp that makes sure you can get on okay then you come up here and then you take your walls and you can basically see how i double stack those with the two with the ceiling there and the foundation there this is you can go more than double stack by the way this is just simply double stacking it so then you go to the next spot and one and then if i had another wall i could double stack it let's grab some walls and i'll show you guys and then you can use fence foundations to stack it even more all right where are my walls at let's grab those All right, I'm just gonna fly over there so I don't have to keep like jumping up on the raft. Like I said, you want to definitely make a um a ramp and put a ramp up there so that you can actually get onto the ramp. Okay, no, I, I I don't want you to move. Okay, so now we got two. Remember, this this is two layers. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two one two one 
two, one, two. Okay, now we have two thick, we have two walls thick, right? And you can keep going up and do it. So if you wanna do it up here, you know we go one, two. It'll basically easily do it for you, right? Then if you wanna go three layers thick, you can place a fence foundation and bam, now you have three layers thick. And I think you can even go one more time. Let me see, you might have to go to the outside. Let me see if I have to go to the outside. Let me see. Yeah, see? Then we can go out here. One, two. Now we have four layer thick walls. And see, when you place the ceilings, let me let me ex like, uh, give you an example. Let me go ahead and grab some ceilings. I'll show you. The multi-layer walls allow you to put multiple ceilings. So it, it's a little bit tricky, right? You might not be able to get all four ceilings on there because of the way the boat, like, you know, of, of, like glitching. But so when you place it down, see, how it's going to get really glitchy. See how it's shifting between all of them? So basically what I do is I just like try to look as far right as I, or far left as I can. Place, two, three, four. Oh, we messed that one up. Okay, I only got three. I only got three, but you can do more. And by the way, do the ceilings last. Don't do those right now. You could probably get away with it if you really wanted to. Um, It's just, it's gonna be a little bit harder. I always do the ceilings last. See how it's not gonna, um, allow us to do uh, more walls without this. So we're gonna do this one. So that's three layers thick. And then we get another fence foundation come on the inside. Okay. And that didn't place right. That's what I'm saying. It can be very, very finicky. Okay. Metal fence foundation. Got it. There we go. One. And we're out of walls. Anyway, you go up and then you do the same thing with the walls. So you can have four layers thick, three layers thick however thick you want these to be and then as far as door the door works the same way you can actually put multi doors you can put one two three put like three layers of doors and then you can actually put three doors inside each other so you have to open three doors i i made mine double i put three on the outside three on the inside on my old one so this experiment guys but this is how you basically this is the foundation to start building insane rafts and then you can put turrets on it um, you can put whatever you, you can't put an elevator on the inside unfortunately so you have to put doors you can extend this out even further um, my admin bow he actually put a hatch inside of his like right here where you drop into the actual water and he has vaults inside of there that's where you can store all of your stuff anyway uh this video is gonna be long enough i hope this guy's helped you with an insane raft let me know your thoughts and comments down below i'm not the best builder in this game by any means but i just like to show you guys what i learned along the way so I hope this helps you. Like I said, subscribe, not subscribe, smash the like button, turn on post notifications, and uh, I will see you guys later. Take it one day at a time. Peace out.